Cradley Heath was the centre of the chain making industry of the British Isles. Out of the several hundred buildings connected with this trade, once to be seen in the area, the Workers' Institute is one of the few that have survived. A much publicised strike by the small chain makers, consisting mostly of women, took place in Cradley Heath in 1910, during which they were organised by ladies from London who were officers of the Women's Trade Union League, one of the most remembered being Mary MacArthur. Support came in from well-wishers all over the world, and when the strike was settled in the women's favour, there was still a sizeable amount of money left in the fund. It was decided to purchase a parcel of land and erect upon it a building that would be suitable for the workers to use for educational and social purposes and looked after by a trust. It was ceremoniously opened by the Countess of Dudley on the 10th of June 1912. It is imperative therefore that buildings such as this should be preserved as part of Cradley Heath's historic past when this area was recognised and accepted throughout the manufacturing world as the centre of the handmade chain trade during the period beginning the early part of the 19th century through to the start of the last quarter of the 20th century when modern developments in metals and techniques overtook it.